Congress has increased this year's budget for the Armed Forces of the Philippines Modernization Program AFPMP, by P6 billion, raising the total new appropriation to P45 billion. In all, there's P45 billion for the AFPMP in the 2023 national budget, P27.5 billion in programmed appropriations plus P17.5 billion in unprogrammed appropriations, Surigao del Sur Representative Johnny Pimentel said on Sunday. He said the P45 billion is P6 billion higher than the P39 billion allocated for the program last year. Pimentel said the Department of Budget and Management originally sought only P40 billion in programmed and unprogrammed appropriations for the AFPMP this year. We are confident the government will find the money needed to finance this year's unprogrammed appropriations for the AFPMP, he said. Programmed appropriations have funding sources, whereas unprogrammed ones provide standby authority for the Department of National Defense DND, to sign additional contracts for modernization projects, depending on available government funds, including borrowed money. We are forcefully supporting the AFPMP not only because the law requires us to, but also to counteract the persistent swarming of Chinese vessels around Pagasa Island, Pimentel said, referring to the biggest Philippine-occupied landmass at the northeastern section of the disputed Spratleys. Pimentel was the former chairman of the House Strategic Intelligence Committee and a strong backer of the Visiting Forces Agreement between the Philippines and the United States. He authored House Bill HB 1782 which seeks to appropriate P5 billion for the installation of new naval forward operating bases to secure the West Philippine Sea's gas and oil deposits, for the enjoyment of future generations of Filipinos. Last month, Pimentel introduced HB 6228 which seeks to declare Pagasa as a leisure fishing tourism site to encourage the installation of additional Philippine structures on the 37.2 hectare island. From December 2021 to June 2022, or in the last seven months of President Rodrigo Duterte's administration, the DND signed P109 billion worth of acquisition contracts for the AFPMP, including P28 billion for two anti-ship, anti-submarine and anti-aircraft corvettes from South Korea's Hyundai Heavy Industries Company. Limited. P18.9 billion for three shore-based supersonic ramjet missile batteries from India's Brahmos Aerospace. P32 billion for 32 Black Hawk choppers from Poland's PZL Milik, and P30 billion for six long-range offshore patrol vessels, also from Hyundai.